party against you. I'll burn your house down. Why do you pay? They do. Listen to her. They have to come and pay me, or they're gonna lose their job. She loves they it. They have to come to counseling and in therapy. <laughs> we must get your therapy. If you don't get your drug therapy, you're looking for this woman. They're no longer connected. It's no longer the fat phone book for the last year. And next year it'll shrink even more. <laughs> Remember the people who are the fortunate to be able to check out from this hell and this nightmare this year. And it's no coincidence that this year was a musical year. We had bassist John N. Twistle from the best bass player ever. Just as they were to go on tour, embarking on tour. Boy, that's the way to get out of work. And yes, let's hear it for Left Eye Lisa Lopez. I'll burn your house down! <laughs> Restraining orders right here. <laughs> and this year we have winners. You got Ted Williams, who is fortunately now frozen next to Uncle Walt. <laughs> Rod Steyer dies surgery. 77. Let's not forget Dudley Moore, that playboy, abuse drugs, Sire Paul, Richard Pryor's next! <laughs> Princess Margaret. Princess Margaret. Queen Mom can't stand it. Next week, Queen Mom dies. And of course, George Harrison, the first name to be got on anybody's list for last year, died December 1st, 2001. And Uncle Milty, Uncle Milty, Mr. Television, he's been virtual since 1947, and there he is. <laughs> Second year, we have a Ramones to remember. Oh. Oh. Dee Ramone died. Oh, wait, I think I'm falling into a tramp. I think Dee Dee's coming to me. Dee Dee, is that you? What's that day for? What's that day for? What's that day for? What's that day for? Dee Dee says, I survived the Ramones, but I did not survive SMAP. <laughs> what is this? It took them six months to have an autopsy report to tell about everybody, I died of heroin. Hey, they found me with a needle stuck in my arm. <laughs> it's kind of sort of like the medicine in this country. An autopsy six months later. A medical report 12 years later telling us, hey, Ronald Reagan has Alzheimer's. Duh! The second half of Buddha lives! And then it's reported a month or so ago that Nancy Reagan has the gall to think that her perception is the correct perception. When she comes forth and tells us that Ronald Reagan has taken a turn for the worse, he no longer recognizes me. <laughs> well, that's a turn for the better, bitch! <laughs> suffer, Ronnie! Suffer! Remember it was you who cut funding for Alzheimer's research 15% when you were president of the God USA! <laughs> Stand back, I'll burn your house down! <laughs> and wash it down with some blood! Blood, blood, blood!
And on the note that uh, we had some musicians died this year, <coughs> very important uh, musician that was right here in Tampa, world renowned. Nobody really knew he lived here. Dr. Robert Helps, musician out at USF, played like Mom, Davis, and other people before. Him. World renowned, but yet Tampa kind of didn't know about it. Um, Professor out at USF for years. I've known the guy for the last 20 years. He was a great guy. We were doing this. Bob Helps. Let's hear a big round of applause. What the hell? Alright. I see dead people! I am everywhere! And on that note, let me get last year's winners. <laughs>